nibbling doing uh, we got uh, 106 views on that already usually our videos are in like the 20s at this time in the morning so are they good comments people like my my dish yes they do I love your dish good 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 you'll have to read me some comments but anything just else to say before I turn uh, the camera no, around no okay good morning everybody Yay. That's the way to do it, baby. Well, you're lucky you got what you got from me. I had a cup of coffee already. And a Rice Krispie treat. Yum. So, I just made myself some yummy egg beaters with Yay. onions and some chicken that I cooked up yesterday. And I'm having a glass of not non-fat milk. Not fat milk? Not fat milk. <laughs> and I'm having my good old watery Mio drink. Yay. So. And I don't know what's planned for today yet, but we got clean because we got company coming tomorrow. Okay. Catch y'all a little later. Bye. We are performing surgery. If I can get my fingers in. I'm Dr. Jellyfinger. <laughs> Do we have scissors? We have scissors. We have wet wipes. And we have... This needs to come closer to me. It would be thing. And... We have Hi handsome A dog with poop all over his butt Come on over here Come on over here Come here going. Yeah something's going on Something's going on and I ain't gonna like it <laughs> Alright Such a handsome boy Hi neighborhood community He's got most of his hair grown back So we run into Hello, our everybody normal problem doing my doggy exercise and one and a two and a whoop boop boo one and a two and a whoop boop boo one and a two <laughs> is that better freckles look at me poopy freckles. butt freckles that's why we call we that's why we call you freckly poop hey a little better are you mad at us now at least you don't have poopy stuck to your bottom. Hey, baby. He doesn't stink like poop poops anymore. Good, good. So it looks like Sebastian has stayed in his cage. Yep. Kevin did some uh, wiring across here and on the other side as well. I don't know if you can see it there. Yeah, it's not as pretty on the other side. But that's okay. But and uh, this is where he was actually getting out. There was a, a one of the links was actually broken. Oh. So they wired it all together. Oh, so that that was a no. That wasn't a door. That was a link. It was just broken as the uh, the rod. Yeah. So that's how you were doing it, you little sneaky rat. Yup, that's what he was doing. Sneaky little rat, you. Okay, so okay. I'm gonna film these guys. Pumpkin and Spice getting Ooh. their little treats. We gotta give them water and food. Yep. Are you watching Lizard TV? It's all that's on right now. Lizard TV. Hey, she's mad because I was cleaning her high, high throne. What's the matter with you? You mad at us because we cleaned your cat tree? Uh oh, here comes Grandpa. He's the one who did it. You should be mad at him. <laughs> Living filth, that's your own problem. It doesn't smell like her anymore. Clean water. 
plain one. Gurgle, gurgle, gurgle. It stopped gurgling. Hello, baby. Hey, sweetums. So what we having for dinner? My specialty. Eggs make a neighbor. Yay. Yes, because... You're too lazy to get anything else out. <laughs> yeah, this is a quick and easy dinner. And sometimes it's nice to have breakfast for dinner. And this is what an Eggs McNeighbor looks like with a glass of fat-free milk. We got a knife and fork out because I have a feeling that we're going to have to use that to eat this. It's a little sloppy. It's a little what, honey? Be nice. It's like a sloppy neighbor. <laughs> yep. Oh, as usual, uh, on Friday the 13th, we always watch Friday the 13th. The uncut version, Blu-ray. So that's what we're going to be doing today. So I uh, don't know what you guys, what do you guys do on Friday the 13th? Are you the type of people that think Friday the 13th is a bad day? Or is it a good day? Or is it just another day? Let us know. Who snores louder, you or the dog? Excuse me? You or the dog? I don't snore. <laughs> yeah, right. You have no proof that I snore. Okay. I have plenty of proof that you snore. Yeah. 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 I'm going to vlog it one of these nights just to so prove it to it, all our subscribers. That's what I keep hearing, but it never happens. Although I have plenty of videotape you know, of you. Hello, everybody. Hi. First off, I want to say thank you to everybody who wishes Megan a very happy birthday. She is not here today. She will be back sometime on Sunday, and I will be sure to make sure she gets everybody's birthday wishes and I'm sure she would say thank you to each and every one of you. So on to neighborhood community shout outs. Sorry April if I broke your uh, computer um, or your iPad. You know turn the volume down when I talk. Up when he talks. Okay. Well if you talk like a normal person Witchels 666, welcome to the neighborhood. She liked my nibbling with the neighbors. Groovy man. Yeah. When I was diagnosed with my type 2 diabetes, so many people came out of the woodworks and in support and to help me, give me advice and everything. And there was one gentleman who has gone to the extent of creating a channel for diabetes. It's Big D Juniors, J-R apostrophe S, Diabetes Advice Help Channel. I know there's a lot of people out there who don't need the advice and don't need the help, but please go and subscribe to the channel to help people like me. I am going through this brand new and learning and uh, Big D is a big big help for me but I'm sure there's other people that could contribute to the channel to help people like me other other people that are newly diagnosed and just to talk to people with the same um, diagnosis and experiences so please go by and and check out Big D Juniors, J-R apostrophe S, Diabetes Advice Help Channel. Uh, Amber Rusterholtz, I know you've got hurt at work, girl. I hope you're feeling better. Don't you worry about me. I'm fine. I'm in good hands. I got him right here. So, but thank you for, what are you doing? Oh, okay. <laughs> she 
takes she, her. Put his hand behind my she back. She really trusts me. She knows she's in good hands. Uh, but thanks for watching every day, Amber. Robert Wright. Welcome to the neighborhood. I think he's from nibbling with the neighbors, too. Oh, you're giving me the chills. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Christy, welcome to the neighborhood. And she's also from Nibbling with the Neighbors. Pattinson fan. Thought we said nibbled the neighbors. That would be a whole different type of channel completely. Ah! Gotta watch it. I was gonna nibble it. Gabby Munoz. 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 Yes. Welcome to the neighborhood. Amber Rice. This is might be very, very helpful for you. Please go and read the comment that Bambi S. left on Happy Birthday Megan. Her son is has a feeding tube and for years now and she left a lot of good advice and, and some of her trials and tribulations on there so go and read that let your cousins read it or you read it to them it might be able to help you guys out a little bit it's time for neighborhood community credit roll okay so we're, we had a couple of uh, trivia questions yesterday uh, one was first one was about the comedian and uh, that was uh, Bill Saluga who's a character he created called Rain J. Johnson so and that was uh, Terry Johnson got that and um, anybody else get that no one? she's the only one who got that one all right and April Fool's Day uh, the movie. The movie. Uh, it's uh, I, I, one of my favorite movies, actually. Had a had a body count of zero. Uh, and um, Portland Creek Diaries and Terry Johnson both got that one right. And yes, Portland Creek Diaries. There was a second, a alternative ending uh, shot where uh, one person dies, but I don't think that's ever been seen. I, I've uh, never seen that on any of the. DVD. We've looked. So uh, We've looked. they decided to stay with the uh, the zero because it was April Fool's Day. So today is Friday the thirteenth. Yay! I love Friday the thirteenth. And so here's a, a trivia question from Friday the thirteenth. It's kind of an odd one. Uh, the music, uh, famous music, written by a composer named Manfredini. I forget his first name. Uh, everybody um, makes fun of the music because it, it, it's just syllables. I'm not going to say it because that's the question. What is the actually saying in the music? Because it sounds like he's saying one thing, but Manfredini says, no, he was saying this other thing. So, that's it. Do your thing. You are all part of our neighborhood community, each and every one of you out there. We wouldn't be here if it weren't for all of you. We truly, truly love you all so very much. From the bottom of our hearts to the tippy tops of our little heads. <laughs> Thumbs up. We will see you all tomorrow. Make sure you go by and check out the neighborhood zoo. And yes, we are going to have a paranormal investigation episode up. Soon.